about 20 years ago is when I started working with uh, bacteria and being interested in wastewater treatment. I grew that first batch probably in February of um, 2000. By July, I knew for sure that it was something very different. Mary Lynn, um, so I kept coming to the house and saying, you know, that she, she had a product that was, you know, just doing all these wild things, you know, reducing solids in incredible amounts, uh, you know, reducing sludge, all the organics, uh, almost to 100% a reduction of organic solids, and which is really something unheard of in, in, in wastewater. By August, which was just a month later, we already had a 350,000 gallon plant to um, test. And um, I don't know, August, maybe September, October, around in there, we were testing on a, an eight million gallon plant per day. There was a guy that worked for us, uh, Craig Robinson, and he came to my house and he told me, he said, Miss Mary Lynn really has something this time. You know, and, um, and when he, he told me that, I remember he was in my driveway, he goes, oh no, this time, I'm telling you, Matt, Miss Mary Lynn has something. Same results. Didn't seem like, whether we were talking about small package plants or very big municipal plants, we still had the same great results. And from that point on, I knew that the, the, the Super RX was something special. I first became acquainted with Sludge Solutions International when Mary Lynn and Matt approached me approximately 18 months ago to determine how their product worked in, in the application of sewage treatment plants and other organic systems where their uh, product performs so well over competitor mixtures. So we actually found that there are three organisms present in Sludge Solutions product. And these three organisms are bacteria that are commonly found in our environment. They do not pose any hazard to human health. In the natural state that you find them in the environment, they function to break down organic material. Tests were done on it for the patent. They found out that they had their own DNA. They were brand new um, isolates. They're not artificial, they're not synthetic bacteria. They are enhanced isolates of naturally occurring bacteria. And so it's not surprising that in the application that Mary Lynn and Matt have formed or patented with sludge, sludge solutions that these bacteria break down sewage matter so efficiently. And so it turns out that there are three different bacterial species. They're gram-negative organisms and they uh, seem to have a synergy when they are combined into one product and they work very well together. But these gram negatives are actually subjected to a process by Mary Lynn and Matt that enables them to be dried. And in a powder form, these organisms remain viable and healthy for extended periods of time. Pretty well amazing. In fact, we had one of our lab analysts that uh, used to work at a, a wastewater treatment plant and uh, he was absolutely amazed at, at the volume reduction that was achieved with, uh, with Super RX. The early spring of 08, 2008, um, Reliant Water Technologies, Jim Dartes and Jerry Beidelman came on and um, saw it full time and became our master distributor. And Mary Lynn came out and said, I think I've got something amazing. And the last eight years has been an amazing uh, ride for me as I kind of took uh, Wastewater 101 uh, at Mary Lynn's knee. Uh, we have concentrated this bacteria globally on the wastewater industry. We know that it can do uh, wonders in even getting rid of fats, oils, and greases, which is a major wastewater problem. I've been in the laboratory business now for over 40 years. and. I've seen, I've seen different types of bacteria products come in for us to test, and the SSI product is just the best one that I've seen. This product uh, probably is better than any other one that we've run into in the last eight years. And so it's quite remarkable that Mary Lynn was, was able to accomplish this. This is uh, uh, an internationally marketed product. We've uh, got this product in use in, in Europe, in North America, in Central America, the UAE. And they work really, really well.